Alrighty then. Probably actually slept. It's weird. Uh, t -t -t -t. Oh, the game is not detect. OBS is not detecting. Not detecting the uh, the old Mass Effect. There we are. There we are. All right. See what see what we have here. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Thanks for the host, by the way. Uh, Insomniaxis. I uh, did not do not have a uh, notifications for that set up. So I, I just noticed when I changed went to the dashboard to change my uh, details. Hmm. All right. Uh, create match. Uh, you, you know what? I can play them. Why not? <laughs> you guys know how it is. If you want to join, just join. <laughs> Have a look. Create. I need to figure out which class I should use for this. I appreciate it. But go out your way to do it. So, so I, sometimes it happens and I just don't notice. I know like a couple people host me, but I just don't like I don't notice it until uh until after like long into a stream because of the uh I said I I've seen like I don't know what it was, like I like I've seen things where like people like if I got raided, like I would get a notification for the raid and the uh the host, so I figured okay, I just get rid of the host one. Uh, I don't know if this is even a good idea. <laughs> I don't know. Should go for extractions, shouldn't I? Or maybe I should just like quick match. That might be an idea. In before uh, stuck in a lobby with mods and shit. Well, Dirk is dancing with the javelin. Actually, go with uh, let's just change my let's change my load out actually because I want to get I do I like I said I do want to get the uh, my extractions done so with these certain builds. Well, I still only have one grenade on that. Oh, that's too heavy. Actually, to be fair, weight doesn't really matter with the with the with this girl. I don't plan on spamming supply pylon. All right, quick, and we'll go with any. Then I'm any any extractions will do. Uh, t -t 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 -t. I got my little horse button back since Betty Twitch TV are active again. Gold Beagle Stanley. I didn't even know there was a host button for a uh, better Twitch TV. I always just uh I always did like the slash thing, glass cannon. Uh no, I've got four pa four passive four fitness. Uh 
I figured, I, I spec this character like this because I was low on Cyclonics, so I figured, hey, let's just put some fitness on. Since I'm not, I don't have like an over, uh, over the top amount of Cyclonic 2s and 3s, I, I kind of have to like, you know, think about like, you know, like, same with the, uh, same with the TGI, the, the TGI, like, uh, I don't have zero fitness on my Tyrion Ghost because, like I said, not. Don't, don't have a super high supply of Cyclonics, so... Kinda weird. Like, Cause like, you know, like, obviously it's easy to build shit. WANNA BECOME FAMOUS?! WANNA BECOME FAMOUS?! WANNA GET FUCKED?! Re Maybe I need more mods, that's what I need. Feels weird playing this game off host. But you know what? As long as I stick to the uh, ballistic things. Wait, do you get wait? Do you get shield? Re I don't think you get shield recharge on the first couple of points, right? It's just uh, just it's just rank five that has shield regen. Oh my dumb! I thought it was just uh, you just get a little bit of extra shield, get a little bit of health and shields on the first two ranks of fitness, and then it's melee. Then you choose. Oh god. Oh, by the way, I got a. Uh, I actually got my uh, Cerberus Mastery at the at the end of last session, any Mass Effect Free session anyway, so we're all good now. Is it regen delayed? I mean, I, I use Stronghold Package on most of my classes anyway, so it's all it's all good. I can't aim for shit, can I? <laughs> Enemy is still active. Stay alert. I mean, there's certain builds that I, you know, like, you know, Sex Bot, Collector, Turian Ghost, like, usually that, usually I leave them at zero fitness. Sometimes the Geth, Geth Infiltrator, if I'm going for a sniper setup, but I usually build him to, you know, be able to use any weapon. Heavy melee. It's basically a tech version of the uh, of the biotic palm palm strike. Don't know if it benefits from sabotage though. It's weird. I've just been, I've been doing nothing for the past three hours on Fallout. It's weird actually having to kill, go around and kill shit. <laughs> uh, yeah, it's uh, rank five. Even has the same knockdown as the. Uh, well, not as but not as good of a knockdown as the biotic, but it's still pretty good. I thought there was a. It will be charged. No, it's uh, tiny fit, tiny fitness, tiny fitness, melee, decent fitness, shield regen, 
decent fitness. I'm guessing the alternative is like melee. Ow! Get back in cover. Get in cover, you dipshit! God damn! What is this madness? I mean, to be fair, three three points of fitness does help. Like, I I I take three points of fitness on the huntress and the uh, and the saboteur, Turin saboteur. Because uh, for them classes, I'm like weapon weight or weapon damage. Eh, let's just give me a bit of health. These guys need it, especially since I'm using like you know power amplifiers on them instead of, instead of cyclonics. Because I know like. Some people, I don't know what it is, like, people, like, I'm like, you know, you spec, you max out all your powers on, uh, all three of your powers, and then you go and use Cyclonics, and I'm like, uh. Ow. Do I hear a saber? Oh, no, that's the executioner pistol. I, I mean, I, I, I live for it. I mean, power, power amplifier. It's uh, on my main account is what what's running low the mo more than anything. Salt rifle amps and uh, power amplifiers is what I'm. I'll say running low. I'm like I mean like I've, it's gotten below hundred. I didn't even place a I didn't even place my siege pulse. I'm still not placing my siege pulse. Oh uh, not my siege pulse, my supply pylon. What the hell? Buggy. Maybe it's because I try to place it inside a wall. Okay, let's put it here instead. Should have grenades over there as well on the floor. No, they're not here. Hey, what are you doing? Kind of weird. Rank four Gaff Trooper. Power out melts everything. I mean. Gef Trooper melts everything regardless of what you put on it. It's like, it's that damn good. I mean, people who are scared of death will put on Cyclonic Fars and still do a lot of work. That's I think. I mean, people if people aren't in a rush, they'll usually use Cyclonic Far on on a Gef Trooper if they want to do a solo with him. Higher base. I mean, they say that, but like, there's some instances where I'm like playing a Vulture or a Drell, and I'm like, man, I wish. Oh, that'll work. Sometimes, like, just because it, even if it doesn't help as much, it doesn't make it worthless. I think Psychonics on a on a Drell Assassin is still decent, a decent choice. I think because people look at the numbers and think, oh, that's not worth it. It's like, eh, you're still more survivable.
heretic burn the witch. I don't. I'm not. A, what, 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 would I be a warlock if I'm because I'm a, I'm a male or is it? <laughs> oh dear. Bring extra ops packs. Yeah, I guess survivor load out, but you get you, sh you get your shield boost and your uh, survive spec ops packs, right? I mean, stronghold package is is like pretty much your rank four and five in fitness anyway. Like that's why I like it. You know, you don't need a you don't need fitness if you've got stronghold package. Like people like to use Geth scanner as their crutch, but I'm always about that uh, stronghold package. Extra shields and regen. Oh god, 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 oh god. Oh wow, he's having a fucking time. <laughs> One way to solve a problem. Yeah, I mean, to fact, like, people, I've, I've been, like, back, you know, when I was in that server with, like, some of them people that have attitude problems, uh, like, they, I, some of them used to actually, like, like, I used to, because I, I play, I play with the Paladin with an expert package or something, I don't even use Geth Scanner on the N7 Paladin, and, of like, you know, it's like, it's like, oh, you need, you need, you need the Geth Scanner to, to, Take advantage of snap freeze through walls, or snap, or you know, shockwave through walls, or whatever. I'm like, no, you don't. You just need a bit of sense. Like, you know where the you know where the enemies are. Like, you, you can play the game perfectly fine without Gef Scanner. Like, for me, most for the most part, Gef Scanner would help with like situations where like you're playing against Reapers and you don't know what, or you're playing on Platinum and you don't know what the hell's coming around the corner or about to jump through a wall. Good for defensive players, but and I'm not saying it's use thing, but to say it's the only choice, like it's a bit, it's a bit much. I find it weird. You can like, like I said, you can like play like, you know, with with certain classes without shock, without a. Uh, Without even having to worry about, uh. Grenades? Yeah, there we go. Without even having to worry about, uh. Being able to see through walls. But to be fair, like, I'd rather just, like, play the game as intended and not have to rely on standing behind a wall. I mean, to be fair, like, stuff like this, if I had Shockwave, I could easily just spam it like this and be perfectly safe. Like, peek out every so often. If you're trying to, like, Shockwave through a wall like this, I mean, yeah, okay. But at that point, you're probably just... I don't want to... I... <laughs> Is it extreme to say that you're probably playing the class wrong? <laughs> Or playing the game wrong if that's if you're kind of relying on that as as your main attack. Maybe it's fury. Yeah, I guess. I guess. Yeah. I guess it's fury. Because because the fury is a uh, is it's one of them classes where you can walk around the corner and die instantly. So having the uh, having the Geth scanner as a as for like a survival tool, like you know knowing where where you can go safely, knowing what to expect around the corner. Can't aim for shit, me. 
same with the Cabal, I guess, you know, teleporting through walls. If you like seeing a, gr- a group of enemies and want to poison strike them, you know, you can do that through the wall and then dodge back backwards through back through the wall. I don't know. A bit situational. Or if you just want to hate yourself, you can put a Geth Scanner on a Krogan and, and me- a melee Krogan or, or an Adrenaline Rush character and just uh, blind yourself. Oh god. Fuck your solid bitch. Oh wow, we're wave 9 already. I'm gonna say the uh, heavy barrel isn't very- Oh god, is this someone behind me? There is. I'm getting hit with them ninja smokes. I don't need to go for guardians anymore, but it still feels good to do. I guess it's been. I guess uh, speeding up the game makes sense from a point of like, well, I'm not looking for the enemies. I can see them. <laughs> That's kind of why I liked because like Andromeda, they give you, they just give a motion sensor at the top of the screen, and you have all the red dots. You just chase the red dots. You don't even need to use your ears or your or your or your map knowledge because. Uh, there's a motion sensor. I mean, they have, they have a they have a scanner in the form of um. Oh. In the form of um. Of the recon visor on the Turian agent, but like. I mean, it's so situational. In fact, that there's not really there's little to no armor piercing in that game kind of uh, doesn't really make it very situational. Why would you have to? Yeah, I guess that's the point. You don't, you don't even need rear, like wall hacks. I think you just mod the game to have like Devastator mode, HUD, Geth Scanner, Rage, Bloodlust, all all on top of each other at the same time. Doesn't that sound swell? Big shield means little PP. Oh, okay. Oh, you ought know to get up. I haven't gelled in a while. Annihilation. Oh, yeah, to prime people with an annihilation fe- field through walls. Oh, God, the ops packs. Why is there a two second delay? I think I have a teammate next to me. Also, I guess there's stuff like, uh, like, I mean, but the grenades as well. Grenades don't, uh, don't respect line of sight. You can like blow that, blow people up through walls with that. So like, but obviously you're losing out on your grenade capacity. I mean, that's. T- I mean, I don't know if you guys ever see like take notice of this, but like when I'm playing as a Batarian soldier, and I sometimes just find myself like just throwing grenades at walls just for just randomly. It's usually because I'm uh, just trying to kill shit without seeing looking at them. 
Oh, that the list of buffs. Wait, does the does annihilation field have a have a an effect on the HUD? I was thinking of like more HUD specific stuff, like stim pack. Well, stim pack actually, stim packs and the uh, adrenaline rush have the same overlay. It's also marksman. But I'm thinking of like uh, like just stuff that affects the the HUD, so it makes the entire game un un unwatchable. Uh, yeah, some powers through walls. I mean, shockwave, snap freeze, slash. Well, the two slashes uh, are the obvious ones. Uh, the smash as well. Nova works. Art grenades, inferno grenades, cane trip mines. So you know, spec those cane trip mines for for the radius and just nuke everything in sight. Uh. God, what else? I know the stuff. I mean, I'm missing stuff. I think frag. I know art grenades work, but I don't know about frag grenades. All st stickies, but the radius on stickies are so small that you're probably just tr better off trying to stick them to people rather than. Uh, juggernaut shield does that what does that shock people through walls? I've never tried that to be honest. I never thought to try that But to be, to be fair, my, I usually use the shield to like put out of the way so I can like Just get that 10% damage bonus 4 out of 10. I thought we were already I Thought we were further than that. Ah <gasps> No, he left what a punk He's one put with one match wonders. Ugh.